I hope you feel accomplished. I know I certainly do. And it was also very enlightening too. Here it is, the end of September, and we are completing our money challenge as far as getting rid of items. But here's what I want you to think about. As you are getting rid of each and every one of those items, or you've already done it, I know, but I want you to sort of reflect back on exactly how much it was that you spent on the items that you got rid of. The reason I say that is because as sort of a money habit that I've developed and I've been passing on to other people, I want you to sort of think about this in the future. As you go to spend money on something, think about how much it costs and how many much you get paid per hour. Let me give you an example. If you go out to dinner and it costs you $50 to go out to dinner and you get paid $25 for an hour, then basically you've had to work two hours for that dinner. Same thing, let's just say that you work for say $15 an hour. If you go and you go through, drive through at McDonald's, it's probably more than $15. But at the same time, remember, you've worked one hour for that $15 meal. As you buy a shirt, again, do your money math. Now I'm not taking into account the taxes because you put taxes in there and that's a whole nother thing. But it's just a way for you to be aware. And the reason I say that is because I know that for me and for many of the people that I've talked to about this concept, they've actually made decisions to either not buy something or not do something because they figured their time was worth more than the money spent on whatever it was they were gonna be doing. So, can't change time and you can always end up being where you can actually save money by not wasting it on the items that we just got rid of. Let's not do that again. I look forward to challenging you next September and see how it goes. Have an amazingly blessed day, pass this on to family and friends, and if you have another, another idea for money saving tips, give me a call. As always, have an amazingly blessed day. Bye.